The overnight gives me a sense of community. The overnight starts conversations with people. The overnight walk shows you that you're not alone. Loss due to suicide is very isolating. When I lost my sister, it was really hard to talk to other people about it. So it was really important to find AFSP and to find this walk. I feel that I'm in a community that is one place where I don't have to explain myself. Grief is a journey and remembering my brother is always going to be part of my life and this is helping immensely. Talking about my experience allows me the opportunity to help any other survivor. I'm here to talk and I'm also here to listen. The 16 miles goes faster than you think and there are people around you the whole time to support you. You walk all night and it gets really tough, it gets really dark, but you hear the cheers, you kind of look ahead and you see that light. It symbolizes just keep struggling, there is a light, you are going to finish. Crossing the finish line feels unreal. It's just such a gratifying feeling. It's such a feeling of hope and strength. There's really no words for it. It's unspeakable joy. To walk back through the arch and see the luminaria lighting up the night, it's overwhelming. I find fundraising to be easy. I had a modest goal set for myself, but when I started doing it, I realized I could raise that goal and achieve more than I thought possible. The money that we raise goes to research, advocacy, and funding programs so that we can prevent suicide and save lives. The best part of the overnight, the people you meet. We're all carrying a heavy load, but I can help you carry yours, you can help me carry mine, and then we can all get through this together. I'm walking for my brother. I'm walking for myself. I am walking for all suicide survivors. Join us. Walk with us. You are not alone. One night. One goal. Stop suicide. No matter how dark it seems, there is hope. Walk with us. Walk with us. Definitely come. It's a life-changing, life-saving experience. Register today. Register today at theovernight.org.